I cannot wait to show you this brand new and free template for MiniChat. This is a template you can use to automatically reply to anybody who reacts to your story. First, we're going to click the link that you can find in the description or anywhere else where you're watching this video. I promise we've posted it nearby. I'm going to copy and paste it here. I'll accept cookies. And this is for our template to install Instagram Stories Quick Reaction. That way you're saying you're saving tons of time, but all your followers are still engaged. So like you saw, I accepted cookies and I'm going to go try to install this template. Let's click install. Sweet, we have to sign into Minichat to continue, no problem at all. So this is a great place to sign in. If you haven't created a Minichat account yet, you can click down here. Luckily, I've already signed in with Facebook, so I'll sign in there. And please don't hack my account, I would really appreciate it. I'm gonna have Facebook text me a code. This is because I have two-factor authentication. Okay. Now that I'm signed into Minichat, you can see the three accounts I have already set up. So I want to install a template on our Fletcher Goods account. It's awesome. So now I'll finish installing the template. As you can see, the template's installed. Now we can click View Template. So it'll be hidden in this folder, IG Summit Test Flow, and Automate Replies to IG Story Quick Reactions. This is the template I just downloaded. Now we can dive in. So the starting step is when anybody sends a quick reaction to you from your Instagram story. After the starting step, we want to wait 10 seconds. This will make it not seem spammy and make it seem more authentic, like you actually had time to type the message. And here's a randomizer. We use a randomizer to make sure that all of your followers aren't getting the same response every single time. So this is why we add variance. So every time you respond to your story, you get a one in four chance of this happening. If you wanted to edit this flow, here's what you have to do. Just click edit. Now we're in the flow, we can make any changes we want. So right now our randomizer has four different options with uh, each option giving a 25% chance. But if we wanted to duplicate this, it's very simple. Just click this duplicate button right here. And then we can change it and make it only go to 50 and 50. We can delete this, delete this. And we can duplicate this again. So now, after the 10 second delay, we'll go here. We'll go down here. And we can make even more replies. Oop, that's Messenger. Instagram. Thank you for your reply. Something like that. And now we can create even more replies. So, so it just multiplies your chances basically. And I can send this over here. I can send this one up here. Anything we can do to mix it up. And if you get all confused, don't worry. You just click this magic wand and it'll straighten everything out for you. We move these out of the way. And now, voila, as you can see, now you can immediately respond to anybody who replies to your story. And once you want to set this campaign live, all you have to do is click publish. Oop. We have to figure this out, don't we? Bang. We'll create another message right here. Click an emoji. These are heart eyes. That's my favorite emoji. Okay, set that up right there. And voila, so now we'll click publish. Published, fantastic. So now, if you quick reply to any of the stories on this Fletcher Goods account, you'll see one of these automated messages right here. I hope this helps and keep an eye out for more tutorials on the new templates we just released. Thanks.